Uh, Christian, let me share you with you my ego wall. It's up in my doghouse and nobody sees it but me. But every once in a while I walk in here and uh, look around and I uh, say, oh, are you, what is all of this? So let me just share a little bit with you. Over here I've got a certificate of appreciation uh, from Department of the Army for my part of uh, contributions. I have a certificate of recognition here for being part of the Cold War team. Uh, that was awarded to me and signed by Secretary, uh, Secretary of Defense Donald Rothhaus. Uh, I've got uh, several certificates of achievements uh, from different uh, organizations that I was in a part of. Uh, on my wall here, I have down here at the bottom, this has nothing to do with my military, but this was a picture taken uh, by the uh, astronauts on Apollo 8. And, and they're, when they were returning to the Earth. And it just, it's that large blue marble out there that we're all part of today. I have up here uh, some uh, uh, Department of the Army, Army Accommodations Medal that was uh, awarded for different assignments in different places. I have a Joint Service uh, Accommodation uh, Service Award that uh, medal that I was given for uh, my tour in Shimia. I have uh, uh, over here, uh, upon my retirement from the military, I was awarded the Meritor Service Medal for my service in the Army and for contributions made. I think it says something like that. Uh, and of course, I got my certificate of retirement here from the Department of the Army. Uh, and this is my little metal box here, and I just put all of this together and put it on the wall as uh, <laughs> I call it my ego wall. Uh, but I'm very proud of what I accomplished, but I guess the most uh, rewarding thing I have is I don't have it on the wall, but I have a letter from the troops that I served with who said, in essence, if they had to go to combat today, they would wish they would have someone like me to lead their children. So to me, that is the highest compliment I got from all of my awards is from those young people who, uh, who would put that on paper and gave it to me. So those are my awards. Uh, like I said, as I said in my interview with you, I had a good, I had a good uh, military career. I like to think I did contribute a little bit here and there, uh, and I have this up here as sort of my own uh, wall that I look at. Uh, so that's it. And as you can see, I wouldn't pass up having. United States flag up here because I can tell you without a doubt that I'm pretty partial to those colors and they mean a lot to me. So that's why that's there. And of course my Holy Father gave me some rules to live by here and I have that house. And my home is noted there is uh, it was uh, the Lord except for the Lord built this house they labor in vain that built it, and I certainly give him the praise, honor, and glory for all of that. So that's my ego wall. Uh, again, that's not, uh, nothing more than uh, just uh, it was sort of my daughter's idea that I get together and put all this on the wall, so we did. So that's it. What about your uh, saber over there? My saber, I was, when I retired from the military, the young men and women in my unit uh, presented me this saber. Uh, it says on, on the uh, scalpel here, it says this, and as I've said to you earlier, in the military, uh, a first sergeant is normally referred to as the top sergeant or top, and it says to top key, the key to our success. This is from the men and the women of Company A, the 522nd uh, Combat Electronic Warfare Intelligence Unit. And it was presented to me by these young men and women who were part of my unit when I retired. All right, thank you, Mr. Key.